This is Jenna Nikina on Eye Surgeon Talks, and this video is about recovery uh, from retinal detachment. Uh, this is a common question uh, that people ask in clinic. Patients are worried when they get diagnosed with retinal detachment, what it's going to be like, uh, what will this mean for my vision, uh, what will the surgery entail, and what will happen afterwards. And I like to reassure them that actually, most of the time, the detachment is fixed successfully with an operation and recovery is quite smooth uh, and certainly painless. Um, so what can you expect? Well, typically um, you can expect to have a gas bubble in the eye, which will mean that you will not be able to see out of the eye after surgery. And your surgeon should explain this to you and discuss this with you, but if they haven't, I can let you know it's completely normal not to be able to see out of the eye and um, for anything between a few days to a few weeks after the operation. And then you'll develop a black line and a wobbly shape, which will get smaller and smaller as the gas bubble shrinks. It's also common for the eye to feel a little bit scratchy and gritty and a little uncomfortable because it is an operation and there is some healing to be done on the eye surface. Um, it shouldn't be overly painful. So if the eye is very, very sore, uh, if, especially if it's achy or if you're feeling sick or unwell, you should definitely tell your surgeon. When the vision begins to return, the vision will also not necessarily be entirely normal. Uh, it depends on the retinal detachment you have, but um, it's quite common for there to be some distortion in the vision or certain changes in the size of images you're seeing out of the eye. Um, this is due to retinal stretch, and this is something the surgeon can discuss with you also. Otherwise, um, Usually the recovery takes a few weeks, at which point you should return to relative normality and comfort. Um, but uh, anything changing for the worse, vision getting better and then getting worse again, or the pain increasing, that should always uh, be a warning sign to let you, to tell you to let you go back to your um, surgeon for another check.